if your VPS comes with a web host manager or cPanel on this video I'm going to show you on how you can initially configure your web host manager so you can get started hosting your websites right away simply follow the step-by-step -step guide I'm going to show you here and you'll be hosting your websites in no time first of all type in the web host manager address which you should get in your VPS welcome email you will be prompt with a login login with your root username and the password given now once you're you're logged in um, don't be overwhelmed by the functions you see here on the left there's so many functions um, to start hosting your websites you will only need to set up some of the functions here not all and I'm going to show you the necessary steps you need to go through before you can start hosting your websites first things first we need to change our root password for security don't use initial password given by um, your provider because we want to use a really strong password and as as I shown you before we're going to use the random string generator to generate our password so I'm going to open a new tab here random string generator I'm going to use the top one here to generate our random strings for password just one string and I want 20 characters long so it will be strong contains numeric uppercase and lowercase and get strings I'm going to copy this out and I'm going to use this as my new password okay I'm going to click change password here now to make sure I won't forget my new password I'm going to email it to myself so I'm gonna to go to my gmail account and compose a new email to myself with the subject um, VPS WHM password just paste it there so I got my password saved in my email account so it'll be safe here so whenever I need to go back and look up my password just open up my email account so let's close this up and move forward so the next thing we're gonna do we're gonna go through these functions and we're gonna do just the ones necessary to get you started to host your website so we just change the root password first things first then we're gonna go to the basic cPanel web host manager setup so it as it asks for a new password I'm gonna paste it here Let's change so we're gonna go through this whole initial server configuration settings okay so here is the contact info I'm not going to use AIM so let's skip that part my email address vpsguide at gmail.com so here's all the contact info you need to enter in so in case the server needs to send out any notification to you you should get it here ICQ the cPanel theme x3 just leave it that way um, so we're gonna leave the main Ethernet device as it is default home directory leave it as it is home directory prefix 
leave it as it is now we, we have to change the host name so here you need to enter your host name for the server it's up to you for example you can use